Hi everyone, I'm Sean Gorman, if you don't know me. I'm Managing Director of Outset and also, for my sins, a corporate lawyer. I'd like to welcome you all to a new series of our Outset Insights. We know that any profession has a habit of using jargon. We try not to and we try to make sure that we explain things clearly and make sure that people understand what we're talking about. But nonetheless, we recognise that there are a lot of terms that we use without thinking about what they really mean and whether people understand them. So in this series, we're going to try and dispel some of those myths and try and explain to people exactly what it is we're talking about when we're talking about certain things. And that might cover things from corporate transactions or it might cover terminology that's used in employment law or HR. We'll do our best to make it really clear, really quickly, what we're talking about, why and what it all means. We're also going to do a range of series called How To, and in those we'll just give you quick and easy guidance on how to do some of the basic things that we might usually help you do so that you can do it for yourself. I hope you enjoy it and I hope you find it easy to understand. We're also open to ideas. If there's anything that you'd like us to just quickly explain in a quick video, whether it's what something means or how to do something. So get in touch, just let us know. I hope you enjoy it. Thanks for listening. Hi everyone, I'm Sean Gorman. Welcome to our What Is series. Today's topic is change of control clauses. So what is a change of control clause? A change of control clause is a clause put in contracts which allows one or other party or both to terminate the contract if the other party undergoes a change of control. So what do we mean by control? It can have different definitions, but typically it means that the ownership of that company has changed and that somebody now owns 51% or more of that business that didn't previously own it and therefore have the ability to control that company. So effectively what we're saying is if I am dealing with a supplier and that supplier gets bought out by one of my competitors, if I have a change of control clause in my contract then I might be able to give notice to terminate that contract and no longer deal with a supplier which is now owned by one of my competitors. And there it is. That's what a change of control clause is. Thanks.